Piper Raquel's friends are leaving her one by one, and the lack of people in her squad is starting to become really sad. And while some of it can be blamed on her mom, she is also the reason for so much of this drama, and she's had a lot to say about it. Looking at Piper's YouTube channel, it seems like no one really wants to be in her videos anymore, since most of her content recently has been with her boyfriend Lev and her ex-boyfriend Gavin. You can really tell that she's getting desperate with the way that she involves her ex all the time, especially in front of her boyfriend. But it's starting to look like they have no other choice, and there have even been rumors that Gavin might be leaving Piper as well to pursue his musical career for good. Now, the reason a lot of Piper's squad members left her is actually all because of her mother, Tiffany Smith, who's been accused of some very serious things against these kids. Cause guys, she's actually being sued for $22 million by 11 of Piper's ex-squad members, and it's a big deal. The trial was initially supposed to be held a few months ago, but now it's been pushed to November, where all of this is really going to escalate. The reason a lot of these people left is because they felt extremely uncomfortable being in Piper's house, and her mom was the reason for it. The mother of YouTube star Piper Raquel, who has over 10 million subscribers despite being only 15 years old is facing multiple awful allegations that she physically and emotionally abused children including touching them and doing all kinds of other nasty things. So Tiffany has been accused of exposing these kids to emotional distress, harassment, and even abuse while they were filming for the YouTube channel and it's even been revealed that they were being exploited for all of this without even getting paid. There's a lot of information about what she used to put them through before it got too much for them and it turns out that she's been doing this for years, even before they even realized how wrong it was for her to be making them do all of these things. I think we all know how explicit some of Piper's videos can get with all of the fake dating going on and the inappropriate way they all act with each other, and it's looking as if Tiffany is behind all of it and she's the one demanding for these kids to do these adult things. It's something that affected all of them so much that they decided it was too much and they had to leave. But this is probably affecting Piper the most since she's being put through the same kind of treatment and yet she can't really leave since her mom is literally all she has. Honestly, I'm sorry, but I'm just, I'm 14. <laughs> According to court documents, Tiffany loved to put these kids in the most uncomfortable positions just so they could get more views out of them. And they literally didn't even have a choice. She'd make the girls dress as revealing as possible no matter how uncomfortable they were with it. Tiffany would always tell me to go up into Piper's closet and get something that's more tight and revealing. Sophie Ferguson, Piper's ex-best friend, even revealed that she was only 11 or 12 when Tiffany forced her to dress in a towel and pretend to be naked for a thumbnail. There are some real creeps out there on the internet and this mother was making a literal child pretend to be naked for clickbait. Even the guys had to deal with this sort of thing since she'd always ask them to take their shirts off because sex sells. Tiffany was seriously terrorizing these kids sometimes and they came out to say that sometimes they would be chased around the house by her while she was yelling inappropriate things at them and even holding them down while touching them inappropriately. Reese Piper's cousin revealed that she was cornered by Tiffany and asked if she had done it and even told that she should do it. She'd touch all the way up her legs and even held her down one time to rub a broom handle in her face, telling her that it was a smelly Yes. Claire, Piper's other cousin, was even spat in the face one time while Tiffany was on top of her, and she always got poked and prodded while having to hear comments about her breasts. It's really sick and a huge reason why Piper's own cousins refuse to even be in the videos anymore. However, as I mentioned before, her mom's behavior isn't the only reason so many people left, since in-group drama also had a lot to do with it. In fact, Simone, Aiden, and Connor, two of Piper's original squad members, left the squad because of Piper's ex Gavin. Ever since Piper and Lev got together, Piper kept dangling Gavin in front of the camera for views, and her friends were getting real tired of it. It started off with Piper and Gavin acting extremely comfortable with each other on TikTok, to the point where it started looking very inappropriate for two people who were not dating.
In fact, fans started to suspect that Piper was cheating on Lev with Gavin. I think Lev is too good a boyfriend for Piper. He deserves a girl who loves and respects him. Hashtag Lev deserves better. I bet Piper would be mad if Lev did something similar like this with another girl. Aren't y'all each other's ex? A lot of people started to seriously doubt who Piper was even in a relationship with because of it. And guys, it even looks like Gavin might have wanted Piper to break up with Lev. In a video, he even looked like he was going to show a picture of the two when asked about a couple that should break up. I said, hold up, wait a minute. Something ain't right. Cause then I start to taste them. I said, and then I start to smell them. So it's like a smell that tastes like I was like, so I knew something was wrong. I knew something special about it. Piper and Gavin also just spent a lot of time together and made TikToks together all the time. And she even showed up with a hickey on her belly in one of those videos. I wanna take you home. And when fans noticed the hickey, he actually liked the comments talking about it, which more than confirms it. Is it just me or does Piper have a hickey on the side of her stomach? This behavior is why Simone and Connor couldn't stand to be in the squad anymore, since they actually had a lot of history with Gavin and if he joined the squad, they were out. Mainly because they had actually been in Gavin's old squad and had to deal with a lot of bad from him and his mom, Teresa. Sophie's uncle actually revealed all of this on a live stream he did where he decided to talk all about why the squad members were leaving and he mentioned how Tiffany and Teresa were at fault for most of it but that they also could not stand Gavin. Gavin's about to go to a uh, Piper squad and that's probably why a bunch of them left. Teresa's the worst person I've ever dealt with. Tiffany's the second worst person. I didn't want Sophie to go to the GoFam ever. Even Piper brought it up in a video once where she confirmed that they left because of her and Gavin and she even shockingly took full responsibility for it. My members left. It was actually because I um, was talking about reuniting with Gavin. And I even told them that I would not reunite with Gavin if they did not leave the squad. They didn't really listen to that. They still left. This is all my fault and I really wish I could change things. However, fans pointed out that they have a very good reason for leaving, and it wasn't just because they were mad at Piper like she was making it out to be. Piper had literally brought someone back into their lives who they were basically traumatized by. Simone and Connor left because of what happened with Gavin's family back then, and they don't want to go through that again. Fans were also pretty shocked by this whole thing because these were some of Piper's oldest friends, and she was giving up for a guy. Anyways, guys, Piper has overall been a pretty bad friend to her squad members since she's even been accused of leaving Eliana out of things and purposely driving her out of the squad. This not only seemed to happen off camera, but it even made it into her videos. One major instance was when Piper decided it would be funny to prank Eliana by pretending that everyone hated her just for views. It's Eliana, yeah, like, we even, like, like to leave her out, but she's just like, I don't know, And this was especially messed up because it was pretty clear to a lot of people that this was something that Eliana was experiencing for real in the group and Piper was just borderline mean about it. Y'all, in the video, there are so many clips where you can tell that Eliana was for real hurt by this and none of them even thought to end the prank and tell her that it was a joke. Yeah, no. Because like everyone just left just now and so are you. Oh, I, 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 I just drank some water so I need to pee. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not like upset. And to no one's surprise, Eliana did end up leaving the squad for good after all of this happened. And from some leaked DMs, Piper really didn't like Eliana. Well, I'm done. And then Ellie was in there being a smart ass. I only want to be in Piper chats from now on. Don't add me to any others. I'm not replacing her. She makes her own decisions. From the same DMs, she practically also revealed that the squad was completely falling apart. I don't have a squad anymore. I have friends and she even seemed to throw some shade at those who left the squad who she didn't consider her friends anymore. And if my friend want to come and support me and meet you guys, then they are more than welcome to attend. And y'all, the girls are fighting in this one since Piper's ex-friends have since come out to call Piper out for her behavior in some very cryptic TikTok. Piper initially posted this TikTok where she seemed to call out her ex-friends for lying on her name, and then they all decided to get back at her using the same trend while exposing some of the things that she had done to them, and it got messy.
Claire and Sophie even had an entire video where they talked about how they were both betrayed by someone, which everyone could easily guess was Piper, and they basically bonded over being wronged by her. But guys, this was actually a pretty big shock since when Sophie left the squad, Claire was still there with Piper, so Claire had basically gone to the enemy side to shade on Piper. But they bonded a lot over it since they basically went through the same thing with Piper and they were both betrayed by her. It's pretty clear that all the drama was affecting all of their mental health badly, which seems to be the main reason they all left. And Emily Dobson even admitted that it was genuinely in her best interest to distance herself from the squad and even her parents could see it. I'm just spending time on my own for a while. The squad videos haven't been the best for my feelings and my parents want me to step back a bit. After this was revealed, Emily even unfollowed Piper on TikTok, wanting as much distance as possible and basically disappeared from the squad. However, guys, it gets so much worse than just teen drama since a lot of fans actually suspect that a major reason all of these squad members are distancing themselves from Piper is because of her defending her mom in the lawsuit. When Tiffany was accused of purposely making the kids do inappropriate things and even making Piper wear a bikini for one video, Piper actually stepped up to defend her mom by saying, doesn't make me do anything and that pictures of teenagers in bikinis having fun are not sexual. They're only sexual if you view us that way. This was pretty shocking to hear since it feels like Piper doesn't want to stand up for her friends who are now literally suing her mom. And it's no wonder they chose to leave. In fact, as I said at the start, it's even starting to look like Gavin might be leaving the squad since he actually just signed a contract to a new record label and deleted all the old content from his Instagram. He made a huge deal out of it and even disappeared for a few days after unfollowing both Lev and Piper on Instagram. Fans started to suspect that this might mean that he was leaving the squad all before he announced his new music career. However, after all that drama, he's actually back to following them again, probably to cause not too much drama, but it does look like he's serious about pursuing his music career, so we might be seeing less and less of him on Piper's channel. This means that even if he is done with everything that Piper and her mom have put everyone through, we might start to see the end of Piper Raquel. And guys, if he really does leave, then that would mean she genuinely betrayed her friends for absolutely no reason and started this entire domino effect that just might end her career. Anyways, loves, what do you guys think about what Piper is doing? Let me know down below and don't forget to check out this other video for more tea.